Hey everyone, it's Travel G1981 here. It is 5.40 in the morning and it's... It actually looks like it's at night time, but it's not. Um, it's still pretty dark outside, so... Mm. Let's see the reflection of the lights. Whoa. So anyways, um, let's do a review right away, right? I just took a shower, um, went to the gym downstairs, and... Uh, but hey, you know, take a shower. Uh, probably got like maybe an hour and a half before we go downstairs for breakfast, so might as well, right? I was thinking whether to do a beer review or a water review, and I was like, mm, I don't know. I gotta drive in three hours, so probably not the best to drink any beer. Um, but from water on me, though, um, it is San Pellegrino. Now, uh, for those who uh, know this in, in uh, their European countries, they like to say, would you like water with gas or water without gas? Now, the difference is water with gas is San Pellegrino. Uh, the gas or the molecule or the compound is uh, CO, is it CO2, right? Just want to make sure before I say anything stupid. Yep, CO2. So that is gas. Oh, excuse me. Uh, so this is natural mineral water with natural CO2 added and dissolved solids, right? Whatever that means. So we know what CO2 is, right? Yeah. Um, and sparkling natural mineral water from San Pellegrino that was bottled in Italy. Um, which can tell you the, the difference of uh, the packaging of this bottle. Um, and how unique and you know it looks I mean I'm pretty sure it's expensive um, I get it for free in the hotel so why not right um, so you can tell by the artwork done on the um, bottle there you've got well I'm not sure you can see so here you've got the star here which is the symbol of San Pellegrino and you have the word or the company's name is San Pellegrino. And it's not just one one side, it's also on the other side, San Pellegrino. Um, and then just look at this, the, the bottle cap. San Pellegrino, star. Well, they, they abbreviated, abbreviated San. Just a fit Pellegrino. Now when you look at this bottle, it's just crazy wow, how even though it is wet, because it's from the refrigerator, that the label is still intact, where most labels would just fall apart. Um, and, you know, this is, this is great. I mean, after you drink it, you can re either recycle it, or recycle it-wise, where you can just uh, put water in it, and people are like, oh, you're drinking San Pellegrino? Oh, yeah, San Pellegrino. They wouldn't know if it's uh, sparkling or not, unless uh, they really look closely when you drink it. Uh, or pour it into a cup. Hence why you can always put Sprite in here, right? Anywho, um, and I'll show you it's not Sprite because it's, it's, it's already sealed. So it's San Pellegrino. Established in 1899. That's, pretty, that's a long time. Um, of course, it's distributed by Nestle. I mean, Nestle is huge in the U.S. and Europe. Uh, what else, I guess? Um, you know, I mean, you can also reuse this as a vase, you know, uh, uh, put some, um, flowers in here. Give it to your date. Hey, hey, baby, how's it going? All right, we're going to do, a, we're gonna do the review. It's already four minutes into the video right now. San Pedro Laguno, sparkling water, review. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, I'm not sure you can see that. Oh, darn. You probably missed it. The, the bubble's coming up. Ah, crud. Now, when you open the bottle, you want to make sure you get the lower part off first. Why? Because it prevents... Uh, when you get rid of it, it allows you to close this, the cap fully in in case you have any leftover uh, 
mineral water, which in my case is not always the case because <laughs> I probably drink all the water. So, especially when I take go to the gym, I'm like, yep, yeah, I'm drinking 10 milligrams of water. And they're like, ooh, fancy guy here. So here we go, let's go. Review. Cheers. Hmm. Feels like a summon up sprite, but it is water and it's sparkling on those bubbles rushing down my tongue to my throat. Wow, that's pretty awesome. I feel like I need like a soda bread or some kind of bread to comp complement this really good drink. Maybe some pasta. I guess that's why you go to uh, an Italian restaurant. They always like, do you want sparkling water or one just water? Hmm. Maybe I should bring this to the Italian restaurant today for lunch. Sneak it in and say, yep, I got my own sparkling water. But it's good. It's good. I like it. Uh, not not very often though. I'll drink San Pellegrino water. Um, yeah. So this is my review uh, summary for everything from the taste to the bottle to the packaging. It's definitely a five out of five. Why? Because you know, look how hard they go into marketing their company, San Pellegrino, and you turn it around again as San Pellegrino. Got two labels here. Got the bottle cap. And wow, yeah, it's it's definitely uh, a treat to drink this. Um, usually, I go to restaurants. I do order uh, mineral water sometimes, sparkling water. Um, yeah, I mean, I when I was in Europe, I remember drinking this a lot too. We would just order this, and we'd order the one without. Uh, gas, which is normal water, and we're like, there's a difference here, and then that's when we're like, oh, we're just going to order this one, it doesn't matter, and they have not just San Pellegrino sparkling water, but they have Evian sparkling water, so, yeah, that's really interesting there, but Evian here in the U.S., they don't make sparkling water, it's only San Pellegrino, and maybe some other companies that you've never heard of make sparkling water, so, this is my review, um, hopefully you enjoyed this uh, review, um, I know it's kind of uh, early in the morning, uh, it's still kind of dark outside, I can't show you. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to do a in-depth hotel review soon. Um, it's going to take a while to, you know, compile a bunch of hotel reviews, but it'll get there soon. But this is definitely going to go fall into my water playlist. Check it out. I think I have a Dasani... Um, Excuse me, bottle of water review. Um, yeah, tons of more water reviews to come up soon. Don't think any yogurt reviews until I get back home. Um, so that's about it. Uh, please check out uh, my other videos, my other playlists. I have the Hong Kong playlist, I have the yogurt playlist, I have the beer playlist. Um, subscribe to my channel if you not already have. Um, like my videos, leave a comment below on any other videos you see interesting and um hmm. i guess shout outs you know i always just love to do a shout out to people that i know uh, or i watch frequently and i think that you should check it out check them out eric surf six uh the haitian in japan the mix up three and the shoe mice now don't tell don't uh don't remind me that I didn't tell you that these four people are really awesome people and that their channels are pretty awesome. Check them out. Doesn't hurt to try, right? Travel Dude 1981, Travel Dude 1981, signing off.